Now this is how it feels to be alone at the top of the hill and trying to figure out why. Oh Lord, it's hard to be humble When you're perfect in every way I can't wait to look in the mirror Cause I get better looking each day To know me is to love me I must be a hell of a man Oh Lord, it's hard to be humble But I'm doing the best that I can I used to have a girlfriend But I guess she just couldn't compete With all of these love-starved women Who keep clamoring at my feet Well, I probably could find me another But I guess they're all in all of me Who cares? I never get lonesome Cause I treasure my own company Oh, Lord, it's hard to be humble You're perfect in every way Can't wait to look in the mirror Can't wait to look in the mirror Help me out now, come on I get better looking each day To know me is to what? To know me is to love me Must be a hell of a man I must be a hell of a man Oh Lord, it's hard Lord, it's hard to be humble When you're doing what? We're doing the best that we can I guess you could say I'm a loner Boy, outlaw, tough and proud Well, I could have lots of friends if I wanted But then I wouldn't stand out from the crowd Some folks say that I'm egotistical Hell, I don't even know what that means I guess it has something to do with the way That I fill out my skin-tight blue jeans all the kickers in here. Oh, Lord, it's hard to be humble when you're perfect in every way. When you're perfect in every way. Can't wait to look in the mirror. I can't wait to look in the mirror because I get better looking. I get better looking each day. To know me is to what? To know me is to love me. Must be a hell of a man. Must be a hell of a man. Oh, Lord, it's hard. Lord, it's hard to be humble What are we doing? We're doing the best that we can One more time, what are we doing? We're doing the best that we can Give yourself a hand Say, pretty Peggy, oh, what will your mother 
say, pretty Peggy O? What will your mother say when she finds you've gone away to places far and strange to Venario? If ever I return, pretty Peggy O. If ever I return, pretty Peggy O. If ever I return, all your cities I will burn, destroying all the ladies in the area. Destroying all the ladies in the area. When is your anniversary anyway? When June, did you get married? June the 14th. June the 14th. Flag right. day. We met on campus. Uh, DePaul University, and that's north of uh, Indiana University where I went to school. She was at DePaul. And my brother, who has passed away, was working in the dormitory at the time they had the sign in and sign out. And I went into the dorm to see my brother when I arrived on his campus, and she was coming down the steps to cheerlead a basketball game, and I saw her in a little skimpy outfit, and I said to Richter, she's nice, I'd like to date her, and he says, I will Are those your exact it. words? Yep. Okay. And by golly, he took me over and uh, introduced me, and that night we had a date after the, the day. game was finished. And it was great, we hit it off. And how many women were you dating at the time? I was engaged at that time. <laughs> you were, so in other words, when you went on your first date, you were cheating on your fiance. In a manner of I speaking. Yes, in a manner, manner so of speaking. So it was an auspicious yes. debut. Yeah. I see. But uh, she so didn't she know. was so compelling, she, yes, she, she caused you to go against your nature. Well, and the, actually the chemistry was there. Was that strong? Oh, yes. And you took uh, one look at her and you forgot your fiance's name. No, I still remember my fiance's name, Janet. And then, of course, then the, the, the real question is, how long did it take from the time of that date before you discussed Peg with your fiance? About two months. <laughs> two months! <laughs> so you were carrying on with Peg for two months while your poor fiance was making wedding plans. Well, tell Essentially, him Essentially, yes. Tell him why. Well, you, you need transportation <laughs> to come down to see me. You didn't have to and say she that. had a car. Which I had. I see. And but, oh, by the way, I did not know about this girl. Well, uh -huh. the thing is this I didn't want to have to hitchhike to see Peg every weekend, so I kept her car, the fiance's car. So this, this would be the, your, the practical side of your personality. Exactly. When I fall in love It will be forever Or I'll never fall in love In a restless world like this is Love is ended before it's begun And too many moonlight kisses Seem to cool in the warmth of the sun When I give my heart It will be completely Or I'll never give my heart And the moment I can feel that You 
feel that way too is when I fall in love with you. The moment I can feel that you feel that way too is when I fall in Somebody loves you. It's no good unless he loves you. All the way, happy to be near you when you need someone to cheer you. All the way, taller. Tallest trees. That's how it's got to feel. Deeper than the deep blue sea is. That's how deep it goes. If it's real. When somebody needs you. It's no good unless he needs you. All the way through the good or lean years, and for all the in between years, come what may, who knows where the road will lead us? Only a fool would say. But if you let me love you, it's for sure I'm gonna love you all the way, all the way. For sure, I'm gonna love you all the way. All. A neat achievement that would be. If we could talk to the animals, learn their languages, maybe take an animal degree. I'd study elephant and eagle, buffalo and beagle, alligator, guinea pig, and flea. I would converse in polar bear and python, and I would curse in fluent kangaroo. If people ask me, can you speak rhinoceros? I'd say, of course, yes. Can't you? <laughs>
conferred with our furry friends. Man to animal. Think of the amazing repartee. If I could walk with the animals, talk with the animals, grunt and squeak and squawk with the animals, I consulted with quadrupeds. Think what fun we'd have asking over crocodiles for tea. Or maybe lunch with two or three lions, walruses or sea lions. What a lovely place the world would be. spoke slang to orangutans. The advantages any fool on earth could plainly see. Discussing Eastern art and dramas with intellectual llamas, that's a big step forward, you'll agree. I'd learn to speak in antelope and turtle. My Pekingese would be extremely good. If I were asked to sing in hippopotamus, I'd say why not of us? And would if I could parley with pachyderm. It's a fairy tale worthy of Hans Anderson or Grimm. A man who walks with the animals, talks with the animals, grunts and squeaks and squawks with the animals. Polynesia, just think of it. And they could talk. Talk about uh, your feelings of what's contributed, what's been the reason for your longevity. How do you explain it? I kind of feel that probably the main contributing factor with our relationship with each other and the success of our marriage has been our faith, our common faith. Uh, we've had lots of tears, we've had lots of problems, and we've always prayed to God to help us through those problems. We've had lots of happiness, and we've had lots of joy and laughter. And we've always thanked God for all those blessings. And I think that's contributed a lot. Yeah, that, that sums it up very nicely. And uh, I think what she just said puts it on the level that most people would consider the main thing in their marriage that keeps us together if they an analyze it properly. You have, you have to have something in common to keep that union together. What better to do it than have faith? And that's... And a I great feel. respect. Yes. And great we, love for each other. And a great family. Good kids. Love them. I can't remember when you were there When I didn't care For anyone but you I swear we've been through everything there is Can't imagine anything we've missed Can't imagine anything the two of us can't do Through the years you've never let me down You've turned my life around The sweetest days I've found, I've found with you I've loved the life we've made And I'm so glad I stayed Right here with you Through the years I can't remember what I used to do Who I trusted who I listened to before 
I swear you've taught me everything I know Can't imagine needing someone so But through the years it seems to me I need you more and more Through the years, through all the good and bad I know how much we have I've always been so glad to be with you Through the years, it's better every day You've kissed my tears away As long as it's over I'll stay with you Thank God for all those years and family that came from our love. We want you all to know you are blessings from above. So after all is said and done, we are more happy, as you can see, because of all of you and your loving ways, you make it as good as it used to be. Don't know.